Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. Another extreme video. This is the afternoon edition for Thursday, the 13th of June. I'm James Spann. Tonight will feel more like fall. It's going to feel good. We'll stay dry through Saturday. Then moisture gradually comes back. Check it out. That is amazing for the middle part of June. An anomalous, deep, long wave, upper trough over the eastern states. And it is just delightful. There's the visible satellite view. Got a field of fair weather cumulus clouds across the state. Otherwise, lots of sun and temperatures way below average. Humidity values are way down. Readings only in the 70s and low 80s in most spots. Only 76 for Cullman and Fort Payne. We're going to drop well down in the 50s tonight. Around the nation, pretty chilly for the Great Lakes in the Northeast. We had some folks in parts of Minnesota in the 20s this morning. Uh, that's pretty cold for June even there. Hibbing, Minnesota had 28 degrees this morning. Here's a look at the watch warning map around the nation. Things pretty quiet. We note a severe thunderstorm watch for parts of eastern New Mexico. A few uh, heat advisories back in the southwestern states. Got some pockets where severe storms are possible through tonight, but not here. Very dry air. Tomorrow, a risk of severe storms across the Great Plains. And pretty much the same thing on day three, which is Saturday. Here's the uh, precipitation across the country for the next seven days. Heavier totals north of the state. In Alabama, rain amounts one to one and a half inches for the north, under one half inch for the south. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS, the 12Z run, valid tomorrow afternoon. Upper trough rotating through the northeast, and we are still in very dry air. We start the day in the 50s, the high 82 to 85. Humidity stays low. This is Saturday. There could be a few scattered showers and storms on the Gulf Coast, but for most of the state, the sky will be mostly sunny with a high in the upper 80s. Then Sunday, moisture increases will bring in the chance of a few scattered showers and thunderstorms by afternoon. And that's going to be the story for most of next week. Uh, this is Monday, partly sunny. The chance of scattered showers and storms mainly during the afternoon and evening hours. Highs in the 80s. Same thing Tuesday. Same thing Wednesday. Here's a week from today. This is Thursday the 20th. Got a vortex over the northern plains. A little short wave west of the state. And again, that would feature a mixture of clouds and sunshine with scattered showers and storms. Let's go out to 10 days. This is Sunday the 23rd. Pretty good short wave up north, ridging over the Gulf Coast. And that looks fairly dry for the state with the active weather north of here, if that verifies. Check the European Ensemble. Uh, rain, uh, the mean, up to about 3 inches over the next 15 days. And highs mostly in the 80s, lows, of course, after tonight, around 70. And that's not too far from average for this time of the year. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this afternoon. We'll have notes in the blog. The next video here by 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. If you can, catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great evening and God bless. Some things in life are just made to go together. Peanut butter and jelly, rock and roll, the sun and the moon. These things got Blake Sanders, the owner of KS Services, thinking, what can we pair with our superior heating and air service to make our customers even happier? Plumbing Experts by KS Services was born. So the next time you have a clogged line, leaky faucet, or water running all through the house, know there's a reputable company out there on call just to click away. Call KS.com, your trusted source for heating and cooling and now plumbing.